And there comes clear 1200 meters and they sent on their journey from the 1200 meter marker. Hard to play, just being tucked in early on. Highway Explorers looking to overcome a draw on the right hand side. Panza, good to give toward the inside. Sea Urchins in touch, only two lengths off. Ronnie Rockets on the inside. Shadow Catcher, hard held between runners, fire the rocket. Just Vogue's on the outside, out my way. And hard to play, they're the last two racing about seven lengths off. Moving to the 650 meter marker and Highway Explorer overcame the draw in front three parts of a length. On the inside, good to give. Sea Urchin travels up strongly. Panzer's on the outside. Good to give. Ronnie Rockets on the inside. Hard to play. He's going to go for a split towards the inside. Sea Urchin and Highway Explorer coming to the 300. Good to give gets going. Hard to play. He's running on. Ronnie Rockets also getting into the action. Panzer. Hard to play. Comes home on the inside. Panzer fire the rocket. Hard to play by three parts of a length. Panzer's on the outside. Hard to play, hard to beat, hard to play wins it. Panzer sick and fire the rocket and good to give. Well, looked hard to beat inside the 150 when he came striding with a lot of purpose. The son of Curve Bull from the Wendy Whitehead stable. Stuart Randolph gets the best out of him. He's a horse who really turns it on and he comes through to win at 3 Rand 40, went off as the favourite, number two, hard to play. Now becomes a three time winner and he wins just over a length and a quarter. Number two, hard to play. For the Perkins, the Cinemas, and Wendy Whitehead, a length and a tail. Panzer second, fire the rocket third. Good to give fourth. Then came Ronnie Rocket, Shadow Catcher, Sea Urchin moved up dangerously, no extra late, and so too Highway Explorer overcame the draw, and they just faded out late on. 300 metres to go, hard to play, went for the inside gap, came into the lead, still hands and heels stuff, Stuart Randolph knows him very well, Sea Urchin fades through late, Panzer's on the outside, but as they come down to the winning post, hard to play, you'll see a little bit of interference there over the last hundred, Sea Urchin had to be eased out with good to give, hard to play, just started to shift towards the centre, but he wins with a degree of authority, number two, hard to play, that's the running of race number five, the favourites in the winner's box, back to the studio. Hugh Paul, right, we're back on and uh, I've got Cookie with me and uh, there we go, hard to play and it's won a very good race. It had the form in my book. Well done Cookie, this one very comfortably. Thanks very much Paul. When I saw your horse win that little feature race on Wednesday, I thought to myself, you know, he's probably going to come into this race very well into this race and, and it was, I chose the right race for him. I know it wasn't the best of draws but um, I said to Jeff in the week we got it. It's, I'm, I'm confident even from that draw that he'll, yeah. he'll run an absolute cracker. Um, I just want to say well done to him um, for all his patience and it's so lucky training a, a really, really nice horse for him. And to Michael Cinema, who's a really great friend of mine, for coming in to him and, and listening to me and giving the, me the confidence um, to, to have this horse in training and, and buying a couple more horses. It just these kinds of things open up uh, doors for you. But uh, I just want to say well done to Stu. He was so patient at the back there and he just knew what he had underneath him. and. Uh, I just want to say that horse is, he's just a star. He just There's falls asleep to come. and, and, and uh, finishes so well. My staff at home, thanks to them. And the new stable, it's absolutely flying so chuffed. Thank you. Any more runners? Yeah, in the next race, free stage, sure and nicely. Thank you. Here's Stu. Well done, Stu. Nice, patient ride, but patently way too good for this field. Yeah, look, he's a lovely individual. I must say a big thank you to Andy and the team. Um, the last time he obviously just needed it, as you saw, he was travelling beautifully, but just didn't quite have enough to finish off with tonight. We, we had a bit of a bad draw to overcome, but he's a tough horse, he likes to be left alone, and he's yeah. got the good finish with him, so a yeah. uh, big thank you and well done to all the win connections. I don't think you hit him. No. no that, that's a good ride. You picked your way through and, and no, was, shortest way. He was giving me his all, so you know, it's, he, right. he puts it in, so he's, he's, <laughs> I don't want to get him to sour, so yeah. we'll use a stick when we really need okay. it, but... He's got Save the stick. <laughs> Save the stick, yeah. Any other runners? Any other winners? Uh, I've got a chance, in the, well, another chance for Wendy in the next. Uh, we've drawn one, and I think she's come on from her last run. Yeah, so it looks like she's getting back to herself. Yeah, she's slowly getting there, which is good, you know, so we just got to 
get it to jump nicely. The thing is a little bit hot in the gates, but uh, we're winning there. We're getting there slowly. Well done, Stu. Thanks very much, Paul. Right, come and have a chat, guys. Congratulations. Oh, thank, thank you very much. A big uh, thank you to Wendy. He's done a very good job with the horse. Um, I think he needed his last run, and he came on well from the gelding and that. And uh, he also ran third uh, behind yours. I think it was Sniper Shot, which came out on Wednesday and won a good one. So the form line was pretty strong on that. And well done to uh, my partners, Wendy and uh, Jeff Perkins. Yeah. Uh, you're going to have a lot of fun with the source because he won, as Stewie said, he never hit him. He won with a lot of authority. There's a lot to come. Yes, I, really, I was really impressed the way he actually turned it on inside yeah. the last uh, 300 because... As you saw, he, like, he wasn't that well away, yeah. but he showed a tremendous uh, turn of foot and he came on very well. Everything of the best. Thank you very much. Lovely. Cheers. Well done. There we go. But this is, uh, a horse is, is probably the best curveball around because he does it so easily and uh, he is going to win races. Well done to everyone concerned, the breeder, the owners. Jeffrey's Bay is involved and uh, it's his colours. Dr. Haynes, the breeder, he's a very good breeder. Well done to all of them.